Santa Contigo! With just two days remaining, we take a special look at Battlezone 2. And in this week's Soul Buckle TV main event, from Arms Forces Dash 2, the House of Rich Championship is on the line as the Thunder from Down Under Michael Crocker defends against Wildside Devin Baker. KBD Kenny be done coming to you from the estate of KBD Enterprises talking coming forward to you to talk about House of Breaks Battle Zone 2 in Fairhaven on Saturday night June 15th you can kind of call this Kenny be done's corner and we're going to be talking about the card as as it's falling in together right now so uh, let's go over what we have right now we have the House of Breaks tag team champions the epidemic Ooh, it's going to be a good one. Epidemic versus Donnie Rotten and J.B. Tickle. Apparently this is a thing. <laughs> when you get Rotten and an alcoholic together, it's bound to be anything. Who knows? But, uh, I don't know. We'll see. If stranger things have happened. And also coming down, powerful Pat Garrett going one-on-one -on -one against Judge Logan Chambers. I don't know what Pat's thought, thinking lately. He, he change our heart. I, I got to talk to that man on the side. Pat, love you to death, brother. But what's going through your head? You need Kenny B. You need to talk to Kenny B. And I'll, we'll set you straight. And if not, they come down to the judge laying down his brand of justice on you. Anyway, going forward, we have Evan Six, that psychotic one, going against Devin Baker. Prediction? Spoiler alert, Evan Six. <laughs> Sorry, Devin Baker, you're not going to win this one either. Hmm, what's that, three for three? I don't know. I'm losing count. And then we have for the House of Bricks heavyweight title, the Thunder from Down Under, a good personal friend of mine, is going up against the chunky but funky sweet and sour Scott Ashworth, the Hall of Famer, blah, blah, blah. I'm a legend, blah, blah, blah. I do what I want. And uh, so we're going to have that. And uh, the Knights of Destruction, the mighty Ragnarok, uh, Ragnarok with the mighty Bosch going up against a tag team that has been a thorn in my side in the past. The C I. A. Greedy and Frank Bones getting back together and doing it one more time. <laughs> I've seen the Knights of Destruction. Maybe the last time. <sighs> oh, who else we got? And of course, the face of Kenny B. Dunn Enterprises. The Southern New England champion. Hot Shot Deshaun goes up against... The arrogant one, Alex Rated. Now I gotta give you I gotta give him some props. Alex Rated's a very talented individual. But he's not the same caliber as a uh, hot shot to Sean. He doesn't have that 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 pop, that 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 go get him attitude. He 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 hesitates and and, and he and, and he and he looks to the fans and he just ah uh, it's so many things. I could go on about this all night, but anyway. That's another done deal. Another lockup for the Southern New England champion. Let's get him, pal. And then for the women's champion, the Warrior Wolf, Nakomatala, against right now, an unknown opponent. So it could be anybody. Maybe Donnie Rotten's going to throw on a brawn panties and go up against the Warrior Wolf. Who knows? Like I said, anything, stranger things have happened. Anyway, fans, can't wait to see you Saturday night with your old pal Kenny B. Dunn. It's going to be a big night, not just for the wrestling match, but it'll be a big surprise for everybody. We'll see you there, Saturday night, June 15th in Fairhaven.
So the House of Bricks contacts us all to do a quick promo for their show because their production team is too incompetent at showtime to do it. Well, I'm not going to get into chapter and verse about that, which I should. What I'm going to get into is the value of this, the House of Bricks Heavyweight Championship. Now, this is something you have to work for. You have to bust your ass for. And this is something that I take pride in for being the best wrestler in this region. And now I come to find out that this has to be defended against an aging clown. Yeah, you got a chunky monkey, Scott Ashworth. Oh, we're going to send him out with a title shot that he never got from the House of Bricks. Well, news flash House of Bricks. He had title opportunities in the past, and he hasn't had title opportunities because he's old and he's washed up, and he has no business competing for this title. Well, I know that he's been a buddy of yours for years, and since you have had a little bit of fun with your buddy Tim Weisberg trying to take me out of this company, I'm going to take your pal and put him down for good. And that way I don't have to worry about him or any other stupid gimmick coming out from the past. This title is going to be around my waist for the foreseeable future. So you just need to get used to it and pay respect to the rightful heavyweight champion. Woo! Bones, baby. <laughs> CIA back in action. That's right. House of Bricks, here we come. Nights of Destruction, huh. we're taking you out. CIA is back. Fairhaven, Mass, we are gonna show the mighty Bosch, Ragnarok, that they got nothing for us. Why, we are the best. Tell them about it, Frank. <laughs> because you see, our time in HOB, was all fun and games. You see, we beat Pumpalicious. We beat Middlesex Express. Ooh. But we've never got a shot at this HOB Tag Team Championship. Yeah, that's what we want, baby. So let me tell you what's gonna happen this Saturday night at Fairhaven, Massachusetts. Oh, yeah. The Knights of Destruction against CIA. Ah. Power for speed. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> So, what it all adds up to is we will see you Saturday night. And I hope you're prepared for us because we're always prepared for a fight. Right? That's right, baby. Because we fight for fun! And H.O.B. really stands for Heart of Bones. <laughs> Come on, House of Bricks. You saw what the Knights of Destruction can do at your Slam Fest too. And then, you tried to keep my boys out of the ring at your Armed Forces Bash. The Mighty Bosch Ragnarok will be at Battle Zone 2. June 15th, Fairhaven VFW. Whatever you have to throw at them, we'll see you in the ring. How's the brick? Fairhaven, Massachusetts, June 11th, VWF Hall. I have just found out that apparently House of Brick has said I've waged war on all the bakers. So wouldn't that make sense that I've waged war on David, Devin, and the ultimate old Brick? But I think none of you really understand what happened and why I'm in House of Brick. So here's a little story, just a short, tiny one. So I'm sitting there, and I get a phone call, and, you know, I've literally taken two years off, and it's Brickhouse Baker asking me to come back. You know why he's asking me to come back? Because his son just can't cut it anymore, and he actually needed a star. So I was like, you know what? I'll do that favor for you, Brick, because literally you've always been that person, always giving me hugs, always giving me hot dogs, paid me on time. But it's just funny that not even their father can think that Devin or David can make it. I don't blame them. I mean, David already quit and won't come back. And Devin, well, I just really haven't even got close to him yet. I mean, keyword being yet. But we'll see what happens. But honestly, 
I think it's pretty funny that House of Brick is, thinks that I've waged war on just the Bakers. But I've waged war on everyone that is this new millennial wrestler because I hate them all. I just hate every one of them. Because I work a real-time job because when I was actually becoming a wrestler, that's all I did. I didn't go and pretend and do all these stupid things and then, you know, buy gear off of some website. I had someone make my gear. I had someone measure my stuff because that's what we did. I had to send people tapes and DVDs and headshots. I had to go places and do things. Unlike this new age guys, where they put this stuff on YouTube and then they'll do anything, but they, they don't know what's wrong with the ring or they can't put it together. See, the thing is, in actuality, I, I just really hate everything that happened to the wrestling business. So the reason why I'm back is to bring back the old feeling of wrestling. And if that's the blood, and if that's the chairs and the violence and the actual wrestling, and not the entertainment value, that's what I'm going to do. I'll see you guys all on June 15th.
ways. And he's submitted the proper documentation. I can tell you right now, I have a good authority. No documentation. What is that? He was fine and healthy to me. What do you know? Your vacation is here for four And I'm coming in to compete. Here's the answer. No rules across. Daddy will bring the papers. They all love me. I'm the champ for crying out loud. Do you think he was a unicorn running at him with his finger on top of his forehead like that? No. 
midsection by Foster. Oh, can't get Foster hooking the rope. Lateral press, feet on the rope. 